And hello everyone, Owen Azuris here, doing day two of our monster train. Daily run. Trying to get me those card borders. Wait. Let's do that again here. I need to hit challenges first, then I need to hit play, daily challenge. And let us see who we're playing. We've got the Awoken here, using their Sentinel creature. Restores one health per stack at the end of a turn, decreases every turn for its regen ability. Oh, that's just the cards I start with. I guess he doesn't have a regen ability. And Hellhorned, eh, deal two damage. Not really the best card in the world, but we'll make it work. So he got Razor Sharp Edge, Welder Helper. Try saying that real fast. And Restoring Retreat, so some healing and a crappy creature. I mean, yesterday I didn't feel too good about the run using two sets of creatures, the only two I haven't unlocked, and I still won. It wasn't even that hard. Some touch-and-go moments there. Gain a random artifact after every battle? Oh my god. Friendly units... Oh, these are all the challenges. Okay. I was like, am I getting to pick one of these? But no. Artifacts, friendly units, enter... Wow, they can't do anything. Okay. Let's make this work best we can. I really don't know if that mutator, how far I will get. Rejuvenate deal 20 damage. For days two. Let's take this. Get an artifact. Sting spells get plus 10 power and piercing. You might hear a little thunder in the background. I think the thunderstorm's about to hit here. You summon a second unit during a turn game three. Yeah, can't go wrong with that. Okay, let's see how this two days applies to my guys. And really, I guess... I should summon a lot of stuff on the top floor. And let the enemies come to me. And then also, if I have anything with thorns... Deal 20 damage to front enemy unit. Okay, let's put that up here. And let's give him armor. Okay. little extra attack. And I guess put my train steward here. Let's see what happens. Uh oh indeed. So these guys can't even hit that. Okay, well I want the money, so let's take her out. He's going to take... Oh, this guy can only defend. Let's increase his power a little. Yeah, creatures with thorns would be real nice here. I mean, this first battle should be... Easy enough, I guess. Yeah, I'm just not going to deal enough damage to this guy, so he's going to... Oh, but he only defends, so I don't really care if he makes it all the way up. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, that's really all I can do right now. And none of my troops anything if they get wait why did that deal damage to him oh 
Deal 20 damage whenever he gets healed. Okay. I completely misunderstood that ability. I do not play with the Awoken that much. Okay, take this guy out. Then I can take him out. Let's go ahead and make him stronger. I was hoping you'd get unstunned. Guess not. Descend a unit and restore 10 health. Now we're going to keep him up there. Here, take two damage. damage to him. Eight more battles. Then we get a random artifact out of it. I like it. Friendly units gain plus two on slay. So after dealing a killing blow, they get plus two. Nice. Wish I'd got some healing. Four attack and four spikes. That should work. Apply ten rage. I rage three to friendly units. It's all units. We'll take that. And next up, Merchant of Magic. Oh wait, it's letting me pick which side I go to. Okay. Normally, yesterday, it didn't let me pick. Forge units, renew power, awoken unit, hellborn unit. Um, I'm going to forge my units. It's an awoken unit. Sweep. I'll take the other. Starts off more powerful. Create a unit with spikes of four. <laughs> Throw that on you. <laughs> and I would let him attack first. <laughs> no, you know what? I actually want to remove the card instead. Really don't need those torch cards. So let's get rid of that. Get a unit range seven. Aside from my champion, he's going to be like my kill card. For now. So I don't want to give non-boss units four. And take him up to six. You know what? Let's do it. I think that gets me more points anyways. If I happen to die, I happen to die. Go ahead and bring you up there. And on up. Hmm. Let's add this powerful floor up here. Put my train steward there. Let's go and summon both of these, so at least they'll be kind of ready. They aren't going to be able to attack this turn, or when these guys get up here, but... And for you... 
Alright, we'll get rid of that, I guess. They're gonna kill him. Darn it. Yeah, with we'll sweep, this will be nice. We'll deal 37 damage to all enemies. We can handle that for now. I'm sorry I didn't get that money. So that should kill them. Almost. So he'll get one attack on my pyre. I'm not super happy about that. I'm gonna take him out. Ow. Not my pyre. I need that. Go ahead and restore. Which damage does that do? 20 damage. Take him out. Or Chim. So 200. Right now you can do 35. Wow. You need to start doing some damage to that guy. Spikes there. It's going to take him out before he can do anything. Hopefully I'll get some restores and can start hurting this guy. It says it's going to take him out. Okay. So you know what? I'm not doing anything. really going to depend on what artifact I get next. I do not know about fighting the next boss. Scorching Restraints. Friendly units enter a Rage of Three. Yeah, I'm going to keep this artifact, but I need something to get rid of that dazed. Regen of five. This is regen, right? Rejuvenate. Triggers when healed. Okay. So that should work for him. Five damage to enemy units. Why not? Alpha Fiend... 60 max health. I usually like these. I'm going to keep them. They should be able to last a little while. So, magic, units, hellhorn unit. Something interesting. Okay, let's go this way. Get a new unit. Triggers enter combat, gain 5 armor. Push the attacked unit to the back. Just the steel worker for now. Let's go to the cave, see if there's anything interesting there. How do I approach the ice fisher? I can copy a card 5 times. is my best card. <sighs> I like that sweep. 
Spick you. When it says unstable, they don't have any negative penalties on them. Let me check. No? Alright. Well, we'll try this. Like I said, this one might not be as long as our last one. Multi-strike. <laughs> so that'd be awesome when my guy was sweep. Oh, I should have done this earlier. Oh well. I thought I might get something there that I'd want to use here, and I did. But now I just wanted to copy. Oh well. 25 extra health for a unit. Do him for now. I guess I can have one that's real healthy. Oh, Dodalus. I remember his name today. I think I called him Icarus yesterday. But his name is Dodalus. Enemy unit deals one damage to the front unit on death. Great. Try to protect you for a round. That's all my cards. Let's see how this goes. Let's try to get some of that daze removed. That's sweep, right? Yeah. That's pretty much all I can do. Haze is removed from a lot of my guys. Luckily I got those thorns or spikes. What are they call spikes or thorns in this game. Spikes. So they'll all die. It's going to take 21 damage. up a little. Non damage there. I was hoping that would save him. So that. Let's see, he's going to take 10 from that. Oh, they all have 5 attack. Sweep. 
take 35 damage. He's going to die. Is that all I can do? die. You know what? <clears throat> Go ahead and put train steward there, try to prolong his death for a little while. Take 152. Darn it. Throw him out there. 151. All right, let's do this. Take him out this turn. Cool. Goodbye to the professor. <laughs> These mutators are kind of interesting, huh? Let's change my entire strategy. I don't think I've ever had a strategy quite like this. Your pyre starts each battle with 15 armor. That could be a difference maker. Apply fragile and multi strike. Apply two regen and two spikes. Add a copy of this card to your discard pile. This unit loses health, it dies. No, I'm gonna skip those. Eh, these are all too big. And right now, what do I need? I think I need more space, really. I got a lot of big creatures. any card, health, health horned, 50 coins, 20 pyre health, don't need to gain an artifact, move two cards. Uh, I'll need the health, but that pyre health, remove two cards from my deck. Torch. Yeah, these do so little damage, there's no point in them right now. Oh, let's see an artifact I get. Spells get an extra upgrade slot. And upgrade my champion. <laughs> Explosive 2 or Bristling. Rejuvenate. Deal 40 damage. 
a front enemy unit. I usually have stuff to give spikes. I like that 40 damage, though. All my healing cards. Let's see what battle awaits us. Multi-strike for non-boss units. They go straight to the third floor. You know what? Let's go for it. These have haste, right? Yeah. All of them? Yep. Get summoned, I think he'll get some power. And yeah, he's still alive. Uh oh. Uh oh, indeed. Wait. You know what? Take those guys out. can't do any damage, so I don't care about him too much. strike damage there. Okay, those guys are up and running now. He's just gonna sit there and get hit by my pyre, whatever. So those guys are all gonna meet up at the same time. I gotcha. Interesting. Train stewards up here. still days. Just saying, why doesn't he... Okay. 54, 41. So what happens if I descend a unit that's already here? Okay, whatever. He can't move. That should do some good damage. You're gonna kill him. He's gonna die.
I don't know if he's going to have enough time to... Let's make it quick, yes indeed. He's dead. Take four damage. Oh, I need to do more damage to him somehow. So he does 12, 13, 14. Good. He'll go up one floor. Give it spikes. Play out. So much for them. Another victory. The first time, or the first time each turn a friendly unit is healed, draw one. That's actually nice. Deal two damage whenever an enemy unit moves between floors. That is nice too. Ramble lash. Healing cost less. Deal damage to the front enemy unit equal weight. The first time, okay, first time an enemy or a friendly unit is healed, draw one. Deal damage to the front enemy unit equal to ten times the amount of spikes on a friendly unit. These are all actually, except this one, these two are the ones I'm kind of trying to pick between. Because I do do a lot of spikes, but I do do healing, I can draw another healing card two random imps, imp in a box, I like the name, but I don't want any of those cards. So, Forge Units, 20 Pyre Health, so we have 75 coins, random artifacts, remove two cards. Uh, an event. I don't need the Pyre Health, though. Yeah, I might get some good artifacts. Coins, remove some cards. Get rid of you. Kind of fodder right now. Sealed artifacts. Friendly units get three health. That's nice. Rage does not decay on friendly units. Let's keep my rage for a while. 
that sounds like a good deal. Sycophant to Seraph. Non-boss enemy units enter with spikes four. No, I really don't want to encounter that with everything else I'm encountering. So my rage doesn't decrease, right? Nice, I like that. Triggers on death. Yep. Goodbye. So I got my one that's multi-attack. Throw him here too. Let's go ahead and increase that. What increases my rage? I'm probably forgetting here. Rage 3, nice. So let's get these guys up and rolling. like the fact they boosted that guy, but you can't have everything you want in life. Let's see, that's gonna be... I would actually keep him alive. Him out here. So he's definitely dead. Spikes. Wish I'd had him earlier. Alright, getting the more armor on this floor. Oh. Don't have the mana. That'll take him out. He's going to die pretty soon. He's got a sweep attack. Let's give him that. Final wave! Take him out. You know what? Just go ahead and take him out. And... Hmm. 
I love not losing my rage. run into a lot of difficulties when he comes up to these different floors. I take 86 right there. Everyone gets the same artifacts, or if these are all random. Applies rooted to enemies when they enter the floor below the pyre room. Okay. Store 30 health. Glory regen. Consume. Draw three next turn. Eh, do I really need any of these? Not really. Five armor. Double the amount of armor on a unit. They don't really apply to my deck right now. Need healing stuff. So we got what? Three more? Three more rounds. And I did not think I was going to get too far on this round. Artifact, 75 coins, forge units, or 20 health, something interesting, forge spells. I want to build up my units some more. Let's see what artifact we get. When you play a spell, spells in hand that cost less are reduced to zero for the turn. Oh, that's actually really nice. I wish I'd had this earlier in the game. I'm going to do that. Take the coins. Upgrade some troops. Do something 10 additional attack. Go perfect there. Give something more health. Let's take on Fell. Alabaster Guardians have Spell Shield 5. Absorb the next damage spell. Multi Strike 1. Let's see how this goes. Kinda worried about this. We'll see, okay, those things aren't gonna last. They're gonna make this thing actually where it can attack. Go ahead and put him there. Cause I wanna get my guy with multi-strike and sweep up here. Train steward here. Mm -hmm. 
build him up a little. This guy could get really powerful, this guy in the middle. Luckily he can't do anything, but... Except to kill the guys that are here. Uh, I really want to get my Husk Hermit. Yeah, I can bring another guy in. for a turn. Good, good. Armor sucks, but... Wait, this will do 40 damage to him. That just takes him out. Regeneration for now. It's going to be an interesting battle. It gets rooted. Quit giving all these guys armor, I hate that. So, I need to go ahead and summon this guy. Yeah, I didn't really want to use this. I said I should have used that first, but I was going to use it. I didn't really want to use it. Two more rounds. I got to live through. Take all of them out. So first off, if I cast this now, spells in the hand. 
Oh, it's literal when it means spells in the hand. I thought it meant creatures too. And I was incorrect in that. Go. Okay, he's up here. I actually like that. He's taking on my premier guys. He fought an Armageddon. Wow. And do some more damage to him. We can at least take him below a thousand life. Nice. Makes me feel a little more confident about fighting them. armor there. Give this um, regeneration here. Can I use that restore right now like an interrupt? That'd be awesome. Sixty. That's wow. I wish I had this hand when he was up one floor. Generation. 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 After this, I'll be two more battles. I think I'm going to survive this one. Yeah, I should. My main, you know, or my main party's on the top here. I hadn't played another game after I played yesterday, the Daily Challenge, and done really bad. I'll be up to two in a row. At least I'll be up to two in a row in Daily Challenge, as if I can beat the next two battles. That's a big if. adds an additional one per stack. Nice. We definitely want that. Double the amount of rage on friendly units. Is that on the floor? It affects one floor. Yeah, why don't want to take that? I want to have a lot of capacity on the floors. Artifact, duplicate, pyre, upgrade, merchant, mm, 
I wonder what that artifact will be. It could be something really good. Let's go ahead and get the artifact. Pyre gets 40. Friendly units enter with 5 armor. Like it. Spikes 10. 60 damage to unit up front whenever it's healed. We're taking that. Duplicate any card. Where is... My multi-striker. Yes. You will do just fine. Wish I could have removed a couple of cards from my deck, but hopefully next turn I'll be able to do that. Non-boss enemy units restore all health when they move floors. Three... 130. Ooh. That's 400 coins, though. No, we'll play it safe. Deals 5 damage to front unit. Okay, I can handle that. Oh, I wish that thing artifact dealt 3 damage. But it is what it is. put you out here already. I can go ahead and make healing free on this floor. And still have room for my other guy that I want to bring in. Start building up these floors. Well, these guys, by the time they get up here, will die. Sweet. <laughs> oh, there we go. Take the brunt of these attacks. So much for the train steward. this. Oh, you were rooted. I got you. I wondered why I was still around. Give it four spikes. Give this guy some more armor. Yeah, he's rooted. So I guess we have another turn with him. Now he's rooted. Let's go ahead and start regenerating. guys some un not going away rage I like it 
course, this guy got healed a lot. I'll survive, though. Oh, that's right, I got two of these guys in the multi-attack. So it's coming in rank one, okay. Usually one and zero, I'm pretty good at beating. Never even looked at what covenant I was on. Basically, the covenants are ways of increasing in difficulty. They start putting more bad cards in your deck, making enemies more powerful, things like that. I just realized I didn't give him... Oh, okay. That gives him that armor. That's cool. Thought it meant maybe the other front character. I don't ask what I meant by that. Double the amount of rage. I really want to cast that. This will make all my other spells cheap. How much rage does he have? Ten. Oh, this is all friendly units. My goodness. It's currently 45. Yeah, that's going to be a lot of damage. to cast that. Consume pile. Yeah, last stand is nice, though, even if it does get consumed. Wow, 107 attack. That is... that's a lot. Let's see if I can get this guy... come on. Get him up and running. Take him out before he even gets a chance to attack me. So all we got left is this Joker down here. Be gone soon. You aren't going anywhere. last guy. Give him regen. Five. I must say, versus Slay the Spire, this game is a lot easier, at least in the beginning stages. Because I very seldom lose a game of this unless I'm just playing dreadfully or get really bad cards I don't know how to use. Turn. Yeah, come on up to the next floor, see how that goes for you. Yeah, that's just flat out death. guys. That is power. At the start of your turn, add a sting spell to your hand. Deal 10 damage. Do I really need that? 
Wait, it just adds it. Deals 10 damage to a front enemy. Yeah, why not? Restore 30 health, apply 3 regen. Nah, I like my deck like it is. Oh. Duplicate, forge spells, remove two cards, random artifacts, units, higher health. Let's do this. Two cards. I never use this. Get rid of it. I never use this. Get rid of it. Put your spells. Duplicate. Let's see the artifacts. Conserve mana between turns. Gain four stacks of armor each time. It's applied to friendly units. And my friendly units already get armor. Let's do it. Let's see what I can do with my spells. I'll duplicate any card. Oh, let's do this guy again. Let's become my new kill card. Great spell to cost one less, yes. Like this last stand. What happens if last stand? Okay. I was gonna say, what if it has more magic power? Or played this card is placed on top of your draw pile. Okay, I was gonna say, is that eligible? Because that would be awesome. Nah, I really don't need any of that. Random artifacts, no. Temper the strength of your units. Only the truly determined can survive. Let's find out if I'm truly determined. Friendly units enter with SAP 3. Okay. We'll see what happens. So he's going to have a lot of hit points. How much armor did he eventually get? Nine armor, so that's five plus four. Got it. And bring him here. Not use last stand yet. front enemy unit. I have it. Might as well use it. Now let's see what happens. I need to get my third floor starting to be built up a little. Sapping my strength again. No, I want the ones that deal. I want the powerful ones. Yeah, I'm getting worried. You know what? Go ahead and summon him. So we can at least start getting them off pool down. I do 60 damage. This drain steward's never going to do any good. Throw it there. Give you spikes. I need my multi-attacker to come next turn, or I'm going to have a lot of trouble here. attacker 
should want to build this deck so big this has to have my multi-attacker in it. There we go. Can you go over here. Need to start building you up. Do some stinging damage there. Get you over there. He's gonna know he's rooted, so it'll be a turn before he makes it up there. up a little. I want my healer there. I can take him out with this guy. Actually... Let's take all these guys out. I really built up his armor, but now he's only going to take 10. Healing spells cast a lot less on this floor. Cost a lot less on this floor. there and start really hurting my smire, isn't he? Yep, he is. We've got four more rounds of this. Ooh. Luckily, I start off with armor. Okay. Not what I wanted to happen, but I'll take it. Still in this. He's gonna die, he's gonna take a lot of damage. Now both of them are going to die. Okay. I can use this. Start building him up a little more. That'll reduce all my spells cost. Start hurting this guy some. Guys rage. I really need to double that rage. Once I do that, I think I'll be in decent shape here, actually. I got my last stand. Okay. So now, I got lots of stings here. Wait, can I use... 
use this to actually take something out? No. spikes, so I might as well bring him out. I really don't want him dying. I like my little imp gets in on the action too. I draw next turn.
I need to do more damage to him. And that's not going to be enough. I thought my little wall of guys would be enough. He's not rooted, no. So that's 40. He deals 30. I mean, I can hit him with this. I can hit him with that. Unfortunately, that's not going to be enough. That multi-strike really got to me. Well, so much for my two in a row. Now I watch helplessly as he destroys my pyre. Almost made 30,000, even with that. Do you get bonus for your remaining coins? I did not know that. Well, so I have one win, one loss on this daily challenge threesome that I'm doing here. So hopefully tomorrow we'll get a win. We'll see what we start with. I do not like this mutator. Starry suffering. Bad mutator. Anyways, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Tune in tomorrow to see, first off, what the card looks like when I get the new card borders. And second off, to see if I successfully complete two out of three of these challenges. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.